Welcome back. Uh, just before we head to London, Laddie Williams is standing by to give us updates from the crypto space. Hey, Laddie, what's going on? Yeah, it's uh, still, you know, Bitcoin struggling to look for direction at this point. We're seeing uh, lo Bitcoin losing that 40K range and still struggling there. And we see the market still, uh, the fear greed index showing sentiment is still at extreme fear at 24 points uh, this morning. Market cap, $1.80 trillion. Uh, that's uh, added about $1.15. We see a mild uh, spike there from Bitcoin. 24-hour uh, volume traded, $85.14 billion. That's down by 11.22%. Uh, Bitcoin dominance sits at 41.57%. We see uh, Bitcoin there trying to uh, get a little breather there from the 38,000 level. It's gone into $39,400. That's up 1.95%. And volume traded, uh, $31.75. Uh, billion dollars and we see Ethereum there uh, holding up the 2800 zone up 0.62% volume traded 17.18 billion and we see the top author market cap is mostly red on that counter uh, we see uh, XRP the biggest down at 1.39% uh, down at 64 cents we see XRP nearing that 50 cents range at this point it's lost 80, 80 uh, cent mark for a while now and uh, seems to be going lower at this point BNB $390 and we know once Bitcoin gets uh, really volatile, we'll see the altcoins suffer more uh, are down uh, this morning. We're seeing them down double digits yesterday with the sell-off we saw with NASDAQ. So it's uh, quite a volatile market we're seeing uh, right now with uh, Cardano there sitting at 83 cents, uh, down 0.46%. Let's bring in uh, Bjorn Martins there now, CEO Passive Income Token. Hello, Bjorn. Hi, good morning, Larry. Good morning, Bjorn. Great to have you. Well, uh, I noticed that a new trend is forming right now with uh, Move to Earn. Before it was Play to Earn tokens, now I'm seeing a lot of Move to Earn tokens actually moving at this point. Some of them seem like they're trying to catch on, you know, on this trend and, you know, could be money grabs. But how are you seeing this uh, trend uh, going at this point? Now, it's beautiful to see that uh, we see now possibilities to earn money and doing a positive footprint to the earth. Uh, exercise, be active, be healthy for yourself, and you even get paid for it. Um, I cannot be saying anything else, and this is a great thing, great thing for cryptocurrency as well, for people to really yeah, support people that are not even known with crypto now can finally yeah, earn money uh, while they're jogging around, while they're exercising and taking care of themselves. And yeah, of course, a lot of people are gonna try to cash grab the trend, try to copy, fork the token and deploy them themselves. But the Steppen, GMT, like you're talking about, uh, I think it's a great concept. Yeah, and you know, uh, traders would wanna jump on this, you know, try to catch the next one that's gonna go up. But for me, I'm thinking this trend might be ending, you know, at this point with GMT, you know, being the leader. What do you think traders should be doing at this point? Now for traders, I would, if you're interested in your support guide, go use GMT, invest in Steppen, and earn those money by the move, move to earn. Uh, simple. For the rest, I would advise people to uh, keep a good eye on the market at the moment, as yeah, at the moment, the market is pretty low. Uh, as you also showed the greed fact, uh, the greed, of course, it's very, the fears at the moment, very, very high. Uh, and but that's the moment to buy, of course. Uh, when everybody thinks we're going to get poor, we should buy. When everybody says we're gonna get rich, we should sell ASAP. Right, buy the buy the fear and uh, sell the greed. But we're seeing uh, Bitcoin, you know, struggling. You know, at this point, seems like 40k has become, you know, a new resistance at this point, and it's looking like it wants to go lower. How are you seeing the market? Yeah, I've also seen indeed uh, Bitcoin is really struggling, uh, sustaining the forty thousand dollar level. Um, but big support, big orders are set on 36, 37K. So to really go down yeah, below that is going to be very hard as there are not many shorts to be liquidated at the moment. Uh, so we also can really make that trick happen. So I would say 36, 37K is a rough, yeah, safe place to be investing uh, Bitcoin. Right. So traders right now, obviously, you know, we know how traders don't like to, you know, buy when there's panic. You know, they like to wait for, uh, the extreme greed point, you know, when the euphoria is high, you know, but, you know, it's, in. It, it's a very volatile market. And, you know, we're seeing the same thing happen with, you know, global uh, markets, especially the NASDAQ. We saw that sell off, you know, it, it dropped about 4%. Uh, that was like uh, last, a uh, few days ago. 
how you uh, how what do you advise you know traders to do at this point you know it's it's not an easy market it's really volatile and you know we've seen you know some traders make a lot of losses at this point yeah 100 i would advise people not to trade with emotions always just trade with your brain with your knowledge as emotions will only destroy your portfolio uh, it's a reason why 85% of the investors lose money instead of gains money as they trade on emotions. And when the time uh, feels like it's going to go down and you're, oh, no, it's not good, it's not good, that's most of the time to invest. And when you feel like, oh, I'm making great money, people are going to invest more. And then, yeah, the crash happens and they lose a lot of money. So Don't I trade. advise on just buy when people are feared and when people get greedy, sell it. All right, don't trade with emotions. And that goes for most uh, other markets. Thank you so much, Bjorn. Always great talking to you. Thank you, Ladi. Have a good day. Right. All right, Ine, you heard that. Don't trade with emotions yes, in any with market. Emotions. Exactly. Yeah, and, put your and, emotions aside. Yeah, and some people will say consult the experts. Yes, and get yeah. experts advice the experts, before yeah. you make any move in the market. Right. Thank you so much, uh, Ladi.